Hey, what's going on everybody? It's Triple D here, back with another Lord's Mole video. And before we get into this video itself, um, I just want to say I am back from vacation, so I'll be uh, making a lot more content now. But uh, as far as, I know some of you guys probably remember me mentioning that I was about to do a vlog, and yes, I am going to do a vlog. I've, I've already recorded all the content. It was from the vacation and I've got all the content in my phone right now. I'm going to probably process it over like the next week or two and I'll probably eventually get it out. It's going to be kind of hard to process uh, with my regular, uh, regularly uploaded content. So, but anyways, guys, let's get into the video. So here we have this guy uh, or girl, uh, Danielle YY from the guild UVU. Now this is only a 13 billion guild and this is a 1.2 billion player in some ore hyper gear. So there's got to be a hell of a lot of troops in this base. We look at we kind of we can kind of look at the gear in a second here and we see that they're in ore hyper gear and the ore hyper gear isn't even really that good. It's got like um like a blue terra vial and two purple terra vials. That is not good for 1.2 billion light whatsoever. Um so these uh, these guilds here have gathered around. We have T dash Z and uh, like the top left. We got P dash P down in the bottom right. KDM up there and uh, JDO is coming in uh, at, uh, up at the top up there. But we've got a bunch of guilds that are kind of half interested. They've they've seen some leaderless T two T four rallies come in and hit her, and she's dropped a good amount. Now, looking at this situation, it looks like if she doesn't get online and shield then she's going to be screwed. Her guild's only a 13 billion guild. If they came out and reinforced, honestly speaking, they'd probably just get rallied and screwed over. So it's it's not a good situation for uh, Danielle if she doesn't come online, of course. Now, with no reinforcements, the only, only a couple of different things can happen. Shield or zero, right? Eventually, obviously, she gets geared. Unless she came online, gear swapped, pulled out some amazing gear, and was able to eat all these rally, you know, rallies over and over. As we can see, we've got a rally coming in from PL Stona, who appears to be going with a leaderless march. As you can see, there is no gear swap, um, and it's just kind of rushing in there. It's taking its sweet ass time, sorta, but it comes in and does around, let's see, about 26 million uh, damage. About 26 million damage on Dan Danielle YY from a leaderless T2T4 rally. Imagine that. From just a leaderless rally, it does 26 million damage. That's quite a bit. Infirms have to be full by now, and it, it's pretty evident that she is indeed offline. So, at this point, we can only wonder, when are the leader rallies going to start getting sent off? Right? So, as we're sitting here, we're watching, waiting... We're seeing some resources being passed around from uh, from various guilds, trying to heal from these rallies, trying to decide, hey, what troop type should we go? As you can see, I'm getting a scout of my solo trap at this point, but we're just going to kind of half ignore that. We're going to kind of look at the guy, but then half ignore it because who cares because they're not going to come after me. Uh, actually, that's somebody who frequently comes into my stream and whatnot, so it was like whatever. But uh, anyways, getting back into the actual action, guys. Um... We've got a couple more guilds coming in. A lot of people are starting to take notice. They see the might drops. They see that they're all leaderless, leaderless rallies, and they're like, ooh, you know, this person's dropping troops. They're not getting online. They're in the wrong type of gear. They're in the wrong type of talents. There's no way this person is going to survive, right? So just like sharks, sharks gathering around um, a wounded, uh, like say like a wounded seal, this is that same exact case. They this this base is gonna get absolutely screwed by these sharks. All these hunters coming out here. We got KDM loading up currently in the background. We're kind of still staring at the uh, the profile of Danielle, but uh, anyways, we're getting back into the action. So we have a, a rally from PL Stona, who appears to be going either cav or range at this point, but could be a leaderless T2. T2, T4 rally again, and uh, we kind of look at the gears. It's just a bunch of speed gear, so obviously we know, yes, it's a bunch of T2, T4 leaderless. They've already come in with a bunch, knocked her down from 1.2 billion. Now she's a billion, 32 million. There's only one way this is going to go, and that is south. Another rally hits down to 1 billion, 9 million might. So nearly down 200 million might, about 191 million at this point. 
Um, now we we can we can kind of I think start expecting some actual leader rallies to start coming in. We've seen a bunch of leaderless T2 T4s and they've done a an immense amount of damage. So what better thing else to do than you know actually send some leaders to do some real work? As you can see, we have T Z Tudu coming in. He does have his actual gear on, range gear. They're coming in. Daniel YY still in that gear, still chilling, and the first leader to get capped. But look at that drop. Nice drop, about uh, I think 82, uh, about about 82 million, give or take. I think um, from that hit, and that was with a leader. So now down to 927 million might with a uh, level 60 leader for that 30% army attack boost. Is that really much to worry about? Not really at this point. She's dropped so much that her front line has to be just next to just dying, right? So we've got P-P Dictator PL coming in from the right hand side, kind of the bottom right hand corner, coming in pretty slow. We're going to kind of check out the gear and it looks like he's going full infantry. We kind of look again, we do a double take. Wondering why he's going infantry because we just saw to do do a hell of a lot of damage going range So why would dictator PL be going infantry, right? Uh, to me, this doesn't make any sense But anyways, they're gonna go with it anyway, and we're gonna see how much damage it does It's walking 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 and then it hits hits down to 911 million might so as I was saying have I have absolutely no idea why they sent infantry it seemed like a very very stupid choice to go and they only dropped them like dropped her like 16 million or give or take uh but as you can see kdm kd3 brat brap is coming in for a rally and is going full infantry so the last infantry rally didn't do jack all let's see what this does we're not expecting a big drop but yeah, there is no big drop because they are stupid and they're going the wrong troop type. They shouldn't be going infantry. They should be probably be going range at this point. There's not enough um, of the front line dead to be going infantry. As you can see, we've got KMB Muhammad 21 coming in, like 21, 27 million Mike Castle coming in with a rally, and we're expecting this to do loads of damage. We saw that gear; it was fantastic, and goes in. Let's see the damage on that. Oh, yeah, look at that. Down to 849 million. What intense damage from Muhammad 21. What a real trooper. Heading out with these, like, one-person rallies. Coming up in here doing absolute work against Danielle YY. And that's who we're going to be wanting focusing on now. As you can see, this 27 million castle did all that damage from... Uh, from just a one person rally with that green rose knight insane check out this gear here it comes in again KMB muhammad 21 can he do it can he get the burn oh he doesn't quite get the burn but let's check it out let's see if he got any more damage on this next rally i don't believe he actually did i think this uh kind of just hit the wall at this point i think the wall might have regenerated and he hit the wall but nonetheless he is going to come in with a solo and it gets eaten too unfortunately enough we've got mia wang coming in with uh another uh rally i believe they used the bunny beforehand and just came in with another rally look at all the scouts flying from 712 down to 642 million might insane drop kind of sorta it was like about a uh, 70 mil drop give or take but uh as you can see danielle yy is down quite a bit of might which means that she's almost down to like one troop type they know what she's got left. They know what to hit with. And T dash, she's coming in. They smoke. We've got KDM coming in. They burn. Oh, they burn. And it had to have been a sweet burn. XE9 sees that. They come in. They they try to take the last of the kills if there are any left. And now we can only wonder what's going on. 322 million light. So this person, Danielle YY, has just gone from. 1.2 billion to 322 million might in a matter of probably 40 minutes that's insane out of gear out of talents no reinforcements because they're uh in a 13 billion guild we've got gdo coming down confirming that we uh did see a zero here but uh there's the their, their uh, rallies slowly walking but as you can see we have a couple solos coming in she is officially zeroed at 322 million might. Such a small base might if 
honestly speaking, really, really small base might uh, for such a big, big castle. Anyways, guys, I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, drop a like, subscribe, um, give me some feedback in the comments section, and I'll catch y'all in the next video. Peace out.